Hey there everyone and welcome to PC User Nerd. Today we're going to talk about how to sequence numbers such as using our personal address list that we uh, tried on last week when we created a mail merge. What we're going to do is add an extra column here to create a number system either so we can count our contact names. So what we're going to do is add a column and how we add the column, we look at our ribbon, we're in the home ribbon, and that also talks about text. So we're gonna insert a column there, or either F1. So you can start with one and two, and one and two, you can start there without typing. We're gonna automatically count numbers all the way down to 15. So you can go highlight one and two, so now you have to highlight one or two. Otherwise, if you just highlight one and you do what I'm gonna explain, it's gonna be all ones. So I'm gonna undo that there. So we're gonna highlight that. And how we do that is you hold down your left mouse key and you drag to the number that you want to sequence. After you have sequenced these numbers, you're gonna hover your mouse over, see this little, this, see this little nub here okay we're going to use that button and how we do that is hover over with your mouse left click hold mouse you don't want to click it you want to hold it so you want to click it down and hold and drag your mouse move your mouse down to 15 and there you have it, your sequence of numbers. You can also try that sequence of numbers as odds, odds and evens. You can go two, four, six, and of course you highlight this number, hold down your mouse key, drag down until you copied all the numbers there, or just two of the numbers will work as well. Just drag and hover your mouse over the little square box and drag. And here it is 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14. So you can do that in many number sequences. Additionally, this is vertically, so you can also do it horizontally. So you could go 2, 4, 6. Of course, remember to highlight. That means holding down your mess left mouse key choosing which cell and hold and drag until you get to the six. Once you get to four and six, I'm gonna keep go to that square box, hold down the left mouse key and drag. And there you have it. Horizontally and vertically, you can sequence your numbers based on how many contacts you may have available. And that's it for the day. Thank you for stopping by. And please don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. PC User Nerd.